Hello gorgeous Scorpio and welcome to your weekly reading. This reading is general in nature so please take what resonates for you personally and just leave the rest. Guidance for Scorpio please spirit. Guidance and messages for Scorpio that needs to come through please come through now. Guidance for Scorpio. Be sure to keep your intuition open because Spirit is going to be speaking directly through you, uh, through the cards to you during this reading. So your intuition will pick up on things. You may see an image on one of the cards which really stands out for you, or perhaps the message on one of the cards really stands out for you. And your circumstances, it may be an answer to a prayer, it may be guidance that you are looking for. Spirit is wanting to speak to you directly. So be sure to keep an open mind and filter everything through your own intuition. Guidance for Scorpio, please, Spirit. Let's take a look at your first card, Scorpio. Be aware of your thoughts. Be aware of your behavior, attitudes and habits in your life. Awareness is enlightening. So with this card, Spirit is suggesting that it's really important this week to come into awareness of some things that are happening within you and being expressed through what you say or what you do, or coming into awareness about someone around you or an environment around you and you're going to be extra aware of what's really of what the dynamic really is what the true motives are behind the scenes so something very important will come into your awareness there will be an illumination an enlightening energy an effect uh, and it's going to be very revealing so that's going to be very interesting and it is going to be personal for each one of you. How that comes through, you may have a feeling, your intuition may be speaking to you and you may have a feeling about what area of life this is for you. Uh, the energy of time. I'm seeing divine timing coming into play here for you, Scorpio. There is something that is beyond your control. And you may be wanting to speed things up or you may be wanting to um, pursue something this week, but it's not the right time because divine timing is taking the reins here. I also see that you're wanting to or needing to slow down a little bit in your in your mental state. So if you have a racing thoughts, if you have any worries or anxieties, I see that there is a quietening of the mind. I'm seeing there is a strong connection here to manifestation power. You, you're you wanting to manifest something into your reality and you have a very clear intention and it's not a frantic energy. There's a very peaceful look here on your face. So I'm sensing that you're, when you get into that zone of meditation, when you get into that the flow um, and don't let outside stresses affect you. You're going to have the ability to manifest what you want here. You're holding this beautiful um, energy in your hands here. Um, so there is a, a divine feminine energy coming in here as well. So you may be having dealings with a strong female figure in your life, maybe a past over loved one that you're receiving a message from, and maybe your mother, maybe a grandmother or some other strong female in your life, or you yourself may resonate with that energy. We have a child energy here as well. So babies, children, maybe in your occupation, maybe in your job or work, there may also be, um, may also be in your personal life as well. I see this beautiful owl here and symbolically, of course, there's wisdom here. So you're going to have the ability to draw on wisdom, not only from your past experiences, though, also from the spiritual realm. We have compromise. So to bring things into balance, you're going to have to compromise or someone's going to be Willing to have a win-win situation with you, Scorpio. 
The scales here remind me of Libra. So you may have a Libra around you or significant in your life in some way. Something is a balancing act and you're going to make sure this week that things are in the works so you're able to bring through the balance that you need. It might be your work-life balance, it might be balance in a relationship, balance between your emotions and your mental state. It's going to be different for everybody. It might be balancing out your diet and lifestyle, getting on top of um, health. But whatever this represents for you, Scorpio, it's looking like there's going to be an equilibrium that comes into play through some kind of compromise. The energy of the bellflower and the key word here is gratitude. Gratitude makes sense of our past, brings peace for today and creates a vision for tomorrow. And this is a beautiful high vibration to be in, of course, having gratitude. So if you're able to step out into your life this week with a gratitude heart, doors will open for you. Things will start to flow for you. So just having this um, thankfulness and gratitude is going to be extremely powerful, Spirit is saying, this week for you. We have the Two of Pentacles. Now this is interesting because... It does have the same energy here as the scales. It's um, a juggling act. You're trying to juggle someone, something, uh, trying to make sense of something here. And it's quite challenging, but you're going to have the ability to do it this week or, and moving into the next few weeks. You're going to be able to sort this out. You're going to have um, things not so topsy-turvy, things not so chaotic or unbalanced internally or in an environment and with the twos it, it often means that there is a choice that you need to make as well around this the four of staffs or the four of ones is about the home environment so there may be something happening in the home very important decisions around the home perhaps or there is an unsettled energy a topsy-turvy energy around the home that's going to be addressed or looked at very carefully this week this card here we have the Ten of Pentacles, which is about longevity, longevity in the workplace, um, having uh, longevity in health and lifestyle, in your home environment where you're living. It's about building up for the future, um, something very strong and solid and um, something for the long term. So you're working toward something long term right now. Um, and that's um, with some with a balancing act here, with things working out, making a choice, um, coming into balance, you'll be able to do that. You'll be able to look ahead for the long term and be quite secure. And we have justice, which is that Libra around you. So you may have a Libra. Um, we've got the scales here. So this can indicate um, justice can indicate any court proceedings, anything to do with the justice system lawyers, judges, um, legal documents, anything very official to do with the law. It can mean that there is a deal or an agreement or a handshake that happens this week or it's around you, the energy is around you, where there's a dealing that's um, lawfully binding, a contract of some kind. Justice is also non-emotional about things and to the point, to the truth. And so I do see that that um, is something that's going to come into play for some of you, Scorpio. You're going to be um, looking for the truth in a situation and you're going to find it. And your final card for the week, let's take a look at this one. We have the Page of Staffs or the Page of Wands. Now this is enthusiasm for the week ahead. You're looking, you're peeking out from behind uh, this this tree here with enthusiasm. We have the red cape on you. So there is um, an energy here of uh, passion for something or someone that you're going to be involved with or, what, or something you're going to do this week. Even if it's a smaller thing, it's still going to bring some joy and some passion into your life. There is an energy here of a message or news coming your way or an announcement of some kind, which is very important. And I feel that when you receive this news or message, you're going to um, feel quite excited 
about um, the information that comes your way. The page is a child or youth or someone younger than you that may be, um, that you may be interacting with or caring for this week as well. So that does come into play. So I'm seeing a good week ahead for you here, Scorpio. There's a lot of um, positive energy toward bringing something in your life into balance. And I do see that you're working toward a long-term goal. And it looks like um, you're going to, the truth of a situation is going to be revealed to you. And a balancing act is going to um, going to occur through a choice that you make to bring harmony and to bring success to your endeavors. So I hope you have a wonderful week ahead, Scorpio, and I'll talk to you all again soon.